Hey everyone, it's Coach Lance from OnlineHockeyTraining.com and welcome to Hockey 101, defining stick handling areas around the body. If you're serious about investing in yourself and putting in the work to get better as a hockey player, one area you can focus on to accelerate your skill acquisition is by learning as much about hockey as you can. Today I'd like to show you all the different stick handling areas around the body. So let's begin. I'm a visual learner and over the years in working with players, I found that this line grid is the most effective tool to introduce all the different areas and then start doing drills off of it. First, let me show you how easy it is to set up. You'll need some electrical tape. The first line you put down should be eight to nine feet in length. What this line does is separate the front of the body from the back of the body. Next, you'll put two more lines down in the opposite direction. I use these lines for a number of different faking patterns and for the planned moves. Now let's go over all the stick handling areas around the body. We have the in front position, forehand in front, forehand behind, and then behind. And the last two positions are backhand in front, and backhand behind. We have to become proficient in all these different areas around the body. Now that you know all the different stick handling areas around the body, why is this information important to you? Because this line grid is an integral part of my introductory off-ice stick handling and shooting foundational program. What you talking about? What if I told you that in a very short period of time, you or your son or daughter could start becoming a lot more skilled than all the players around them? Would you be interested in learning how this can be accomplished? You got my attention. I call it the flip-flop technique. Let me explain. Hockey is a unique sport because unlike football, baseball, soccer, or basketball, with hockey you have to learn a skill before you can ever play the sport, and that skill is skating. If you look at the first two or three years of a hockey player's career, you'll notice something missing from the majority of the practices, and that's pucks. Why? Because if you can't skate, you won't need to learn how to stick handle or shoot. But more importantly, coaches want the players focusing on one thing, and that's skating, because that's the most critical skill to develop early on. That's the flip. Most parents think that this is the no puck phase, so let's grab another cup of coffee and go read the paper. Now this is the flop. While the majority of the parents are waiting for coaches to determine when stick handling training is to be introduced to their players, I've been suggesting to parents through the years a different way to go about things. You see, one of the strategies I've uncovered to help players make faster gains than their peers is to take players off the ice. What this does is it quiets the mind, and I do this by turning off the learn to skate switch and put them in a stationary position so they're focusing on a single different task at hand, and that's stick handling. You don't have to wait to introduce this type of off by stick skill development to your kid. But if they're just getting into the sport, you're gonna have to assist in the process at the beginning phase, and I suggest you learn the drills together with your son or daughter. Here's how I can help. OnlineHockeyTraining.com has the world's largest database of off-ice stick handling and shooting drills, which now exceeds over 1,000 drill videos. And I've packaged the content into easy to follow progressions where each lesson plan or training module builds off the previous one. Here's some of the skills you'll be learning if you become a foundational online hockey training team member. Let me ask you a question. Can you do all the drills that you just saw with some level of proficiency? Nah, I'm brutal. Do you think if you could execute them like I did, you'd be a much better hockey player than you currently are? Yeah, I'd be wicked good. Then all you have to do is tap into my off-ice stick handling and shooting program like so many hockey hopefuls have done before you. I just so happen to be offering a free sample of my stick skills program at OnlineHockeyTraining.com and there's no credit card required where you can fully investigate what we have to offer and see if it's something you'd be interested in to help you or your son or daughter reach their long-term hockey objectives. Just head on over to OnlineHockeyTraining.com, 
click on the Get Your Free Sample Training Here tab, and with a little effort on your part, you can quietly start refining your puck handling ability, shooting power and accuracy, while others are spending the majority of their free time playing Fortnite. Thanks for watching, and I look forward to working with you or your son or daughter.